What's up, y'all? This your boy, Master P. I'm back with another video. I know I'm late. Excuse me for that. Y'all know, like, I've been working a lot, like, working two jobs, so um, I couldn't keep up with it. So um, it's better late than never. So um, I'm here now. So for those that are new to my channel, welcome. I get my content on the Philadelphia Eagles, whether it's the off-seasons, the pre-seasons, the regular seasons, the playoff games, the, um, the free agent signings, the trades, the draft prospects, the draft picks. And the Philadelphia Eagles highlights of all the ex-players, Hall of Famers, and legends that I have done. Some of those that nobody has done before. Before you um, you watch the video, hit the like button, comment below, subscribe to my channel, and follow my Instagram. Show your boys some love. And I show them um, the love back to y'all. So let's talk about um, the Eagles versus Texans game. Now, I didn't get to watch the, um, the game, but I did watch the highlights. It was good um, for them to reach 8-0, and but it's a lot of concerns that I got to talk about. And first off, it start with the offensive line. They, they've been looking um, they've been looking sloppy for the most part in the first half and throughout the second. But they stepped up to the plate when this matters to help Jalen Hurts and the offense out. Like the receiving core of like Jalen Hurts A.J. Brown, Dallas Goddard, Miles Sanders, and Devontae Smith, Quez Watkins having a ball out game. The offensive line, they stepped up to the plate at the end and did not took their foot off the gas. But Jordan Malata, he's been getting beat all game. He really had a bad performance, and he really needs to clean all of that up. That was embarrassing. That's unacceptable. Jordan Malata, you a lot better than that. You got to show them why you are one of the best left tackles in the league. You can't be looking like that against good teams. That's going to be coming up after these next three games. It's going to get even tougher. So you better clean this up. And um, I got to say, um, Jalen Hurts, he had um a good performance in his home. Returned to home uh, where he was raised, where he grew up, where he was born in Houston. And um, A.J. Brown, he had a monster game. Devontae Smith, he had a good game. Dallas Goddard, he had a monster game. Miles Sanders, he also had a miles, uh, he also had a monster game. You see that Steph Harvey he did to Derek Stanley, giving him a welcome to the NFL moment. That was beautiful. And um, he needs to keep that up. Keep running aggressive. Be ready. Run between the gaps. Get into the end zone and score some TDs. Keep that up. So shout out to Jalen Hurts, Dallas Goddard, A.J. Brown, Devontae Smith, and the offensive line. But also my concerns is the performance from the front four, the defense. They, it's embarrassing. Like, I, I can't really explain how embarrassing the performance they did. Except for um, Javon Hargrave. He's the only player of that D-line that had a good game. He had two or three sacks. Um, I lost count. I believe it was... um. Correct me if I was wrong. Um, correct me if I'm wrong. I believe it was two, or maybe it was three. I forgot. But he had a, um, a good performance game for the most part. But as far as the rest of the front four, they could not get to the QB. Brandon Graham, he missed a sack when he was right there. He couldn't get to the QB. And um, Damian Pierce, he... He really tortured our front four all game. I'm starting to get um from him. He he, he got that um that Leonard Farnett vibe. Like uh, that Josh Jacobs and um Leonard Farnett vibe on his runner style like, as a running back. He's fast, he's shifty, he's physical. Shout out to um Damian Pierce and um the rest of the Houston Texans, so um that put up a battle. When it comes to the games like this, when the Eagles goes up against a team who has nothing to lose, 
They coming to battle. They're going to put up a fight with nothing to lose. They're going to put up a fight with everything they got before the season ends. Y'all y'all really have to clean this up. Y'all need to clean up y'all mistakes real fast. And um, Monday night against um, the Washington Commanders at the length this time. Y'all cannot let Carter and and Heineke, McLaurin, and the rest of them embarrass y'all. I'm talking about the Eagles defense. Y'all need to step up, clean up y'all mistakes, get some pressure, stop the run, get to the QB, get some sacks, get some turnovers. Please. Because this there's not going to be no walk. There's not going to be no cakewalk. When it comes to a division rival, they come into battle. They come into fight. So y'all need to blitz, bring pressure, stop Heineke, stop the running game, and catch a pick six. Catch some interceptions. And offense, offensive line, lock down, shut down, that commander's D-line, that defense. Run around them, run through them. Score on them. Do your job. Y'all know what to do. But y'all need to clean that up right away. If y'all enjoyed my video, hit the like button, comment below, subscribe to my channel, and follow my Instagram. Show your boys some love. Let's get to 9-0. Fly Eagles fly.